Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to today's video. So, I am very, very sad and very sorry um, because, as you can see, I've got kitted up diamond painting which is Mad Kitty um, by Mandy Manzano and it is from Diamond Art Club and basically I don't really know what's happened. I filmed a kitten up video, I was sat here nattering away um, about some right random stuff and my camera had just completely cut out, the battery wasn't dead, it didn't turn off, it didn't show me, it didn't make any noise. Um, so all that sort of footage has been lost so I am very very sorry I know kitten ups are like some of your guys' favourite videos of mine and I feel awful so I'm still going to make a video because I like to dedicate a video to kitten up and obviously the kitten up has been done and diamond painting is one of them hobbies um, and for YouTube it's, it's very frustrating because it's like a one shot type of thing when we diamond paint when we kit up i can't put things back into them bags that they came in and do the whole process it doesn't work i can't take the stickers and re put them on you know even with unboxing you know i can't reseal the boxes re put the film back on and stuff like that so there is always going to be the time where things go wrong and plenty of stuff's already gone wrong <laughs> during my time on YouTube and I can only get better from it and that's what I aim to do so I do have to apologise anyway I thought I would tell you a bit about why I'm kitting up my kitty and what I did, the process and stuff so I've kitted up my kitty because uh, one of my friends over on Instagram her name is Tanya and she is the traveling diamond painter um she messaged me to say that she also had my kitty and was planning on doing it next and she wondered if i wanted to do it with her and i said sure so we kind of waited for each other to be more ready i just am doing all sorts of diamond paintings on the go at the same time now the whole system i had before of like doing them in order doing a row of one and then a square of the other gone out the window I think life's too short do what you want to do so if I want to do some of my kitty when I wake up in the morning I'm gonna do that so that is just how it goes um but yeah I decided to get it up so it's ready for when we're gonna both start I'm just waiting she is finishing her Mad Hatter painting um and then we are going to begin doing this together at the same time as me doing like Fujiflora, which I do need to do because I'm doing it for the Fun Never Ends um, DP along with Mrs Crochet and Coffee and Rachel Ray, so I do need to do that. But anyway, let me just tell you a bit about what I did. So, this one was quite standard of a kitten up, like it's very similar to how I would kit up any of my diamond art clubs the stickers were the ones that i had to cut up myself so i cut them all up there is only 36 colors in this one however i decided because there wasn't that many colors and i have a lot of boxes the likes of like number one which is black 310 i just put them all in boxes so i just filled up them all uh, also 19 so 939 now you can see some stickers on some of the boxes and that is because to get sort of the right amount that I needed I used my extras which are here these are my Elizabeth Ward boxes, whereas most of them, and the ones with the yellow, are all of the ones that came from who again, from their like, knockoff storage, which is what this container is. This isn't the Elizabeth Ward ones. So to kind of remind myself and hear what needs to go back with my Elizabeth Ward ones, I've put blue stickers on. Um, 
the ones that are the Elizabeth Ward. You can tell a difference, like, personally. I mean, I was going to do a video comparing them anyway, but I thought I'd do it when, like, I have them kitted down. Um, but they are pretty um, similar and they obviously are the same size so I just thought I would swap them for this purpose so I have like a full box with no like gaps or empty tubs but having said that it just means I have like big tubs with like hardly any in so what I did because it's Diamond Art Club and like I said you can watch previous Diamond Art Club kitten up videos in this sort of star storage Snow Queen is one of them, one with melting for, trying to think what I had on the go, something sweet, anything like that. You'll find these storage containers being used and being kitted up. And because there's different sizes, um, what I do, and it, it works well with Diamond Art Club, it doesn't work great with companies that are like this, but Diamond Art Club send you their drills in bags that are pre wet pre-measured or pre-weighed and they are in size order so the smallest goes first and then you know it goes up like that so I stickered them all up I just basically put the smallest in the smallest containers used my smaller ones then I went to the next size next size next size so forth um to fill to stick her up and then I just started like I literally cut all the bags up and started filling it up so that's how I did it and then I've just ordered them at the end. So they go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you know, and so on. Now, one thing I did do is this painting doesn't have any ABs in it. Um, but I wanted to swap out 3865 for some white ABs. So the white ABs in Diamond Arc were called 141, and I had like a full bag that was about the size of how many 3865s that I got in this painting. So these will go into my spare storage and I can use these ABs and then any that I'm left over with will obviously go back. But these were all spares that I had from previous paintings and there isn't a lot and that's why I decided to use the white. But like looking on the image, it's probably gonna be around the swirl, that little bits in his eyes, maybe a little in the background, but it's mainly gonna be around the cat around the Cheshire cat. Um, one thing to note is this painting does have E three tens in it. Now these are um, glow in the dark AB drills, not AB drills, just glow in the dark drills. Uh, whereas three ten is just normal. So three ten I think is used in the background, and then E three ten is all of the three tens that um, basically outline the Mad Kitty. So when you turn the lights off, you would be able to see his face all like glowing in the dark. But I think they are charged with UV light. So I'm gonna have to work out how I can charge them glow in the dark drills. But, um, Having said that, yeah, I am very, very sorry that you guys didn't get this kitten up because I know you really like them. Um, but not to worry, I have a ridiculous amount of paintings in my stash. Um, so, you know, there will be more kitten ups to do. I'm sure of it. Uh, and you did get one last time as well. So you got like me kitten up um, my Treasure Studio art last time. And like I said, more kitten ups means more kitten downs, more kitten ups. So I'm going to be just sticking around and we always do stuff wrong. You know, there's always going to be something that might go wrong. Today, it's just that this kitten up did not film. So I am ever so sorry about that. But I just thought honesty is the best policy. And if like it come to kit this down and I haven't showed you it kitted up, it's not really fair, is it? So at least you can see how it all looks. I'm really happy that it fitted in the box. Everything's in order, which is brilliant because I hate it when it's not in order. I just took the sticker off of the sticker sheet that tells me the title. 
um, and pop that on the top of this box. So I'm going to go now, I'm going to put the 3865s into my spare storage and sort everything out. But thank you ever so much for liking, subscribing, commenting and of course watching. And until next time guys, see you in the next one.